All new for you at 10 o'clock. We all know that teachers face a lot of stress, especially in the last couple of years. So a few of them are finding their best way to release it. And it's through a contact sport that is trying to make a comeback. Here's CBS 11's J.D. Miles. Hey, guys. Hey. I'm Jamie Kingsley. I am 34 years old. I have two kids. So I have a husband, teacher, full time. So my name is Courtney Reed, and I am 41 years old. I'm a middle school theater teacher. My name is Anna. I go by ukulele in Derby. I'm a software developer. I've got a dog and a cat. You got it, Yuki. Come on. Thunderbird Skating Rink in Plano is where a league of fearless women leave behind their day jobs and for a night of combat on wheels. Ah! It's weird. When my students are like, what's roller derby? I basically say it's football on skates. <laughs> Courtney Reed is a teacher in Garland when she's in the classroom. Mid. Going out. In. Mid. But on the rink, the longtime member of the Assassination City roller derby team is known as Wheelamina Strikes Fear. Like William Shakespeare because I write plays. And I've actually had some students come and watch, a parent come and watch me. It's a sport with a long history and a reputation for being dangerous and violent. But to Jamie Kingsley, who's a sixth grade math teacher in Carrollton, it's a much needed way to release stress. Go, go, go. This is what I do to kind of like decompress and go back home, be a better person for my family. It's challenging and it's exercise and I don't have to like get on a treadmill. <laughs> Anna Mayer is one of the youngest members of the team that shoves and blocks its way around the rink to score points against other teams that are trying to do the same. This summer's games had fans filling up rinks to watch the action between women who accept the risk that comes with it. I've um, broken my foot. I have had back surgery. I have partially torn a um, muscle in my shoulder. And it broke it, like this. Really bad dislocation. Broken legs, torn rotator cuffs, and a lot of bruises. Just about everyone out here has suffered some sort of injury, but they keep coming back. It's a hobby that clearly isn't for everyone, but to those who lace up for it, roller derby is an addiction. I get something out of roller derby that I don't get out of any other part of my life. It's my healthy outlet. It is something that is only and strictly for myself. And why not? It's fun. <laughs> JD Miles, CBS 11 News. Did I just count like three surgeries and like five broken bones? <laughs> yep. <laughs> really? There's one more chance to uh, catch the roller derby this season. That team's getting together Saturday, 7 o'clock at night, Thunderbird Skating Rink in Plano. If you'd like to go check them out, and we know they'd love your support. <laughs>